Hello there. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to convert these two little gliders I have here. Okay, so this is the 2022 version, the slim version, with the thick trailing edge, okay, into a gullwing glider like this, okay. Okay, so I'll get a, a knife that's going to be thick enough to go through, put it on the edge of a cutting board, steel ruler, Find your centre line, which is easy enough to do because there's this markings in the centre and you'll find the centre one. So mark it up, bend the ruler and do a nice clean cut. About 90 degrees, you want to try and get it as best you can. Small shallow cuts, don't try and do it all in one go. Okay, so there we go, we've got two halves. I mean, I've got it perfectly in line there, but it'll do. Okay, so I'll cut that bit off. There we go. Need to set these up as a gull wing. So I'll get your left hand side first, like this. I'll make these templates available for you. So basically, you set up the paper templates onto the wing to get on with tape. So line up with your leading edge, make sure it's over the edge there, like that. Stick that down, we're going to be doing a straight cut down there at 90 degrees. You then uh, put your other template on, like that, and we'll do another 90 degrees on that cut. Okay, then that cut there will be done at an angle, like that, but we'll do that later. Right, so I'm going to cut these out. Okay, so I've put, stuck the leading edge on, like that, and you can see it's nice and straight, and it's to that edge. So I'm going to do my first cut.
Okay, so there's my first cut. You can see it's at 90 degrees. So 90 degrees like that. Now I need to trim off that back edge. Incidentally, you can see that point there, that's where the bend was. The dihedral, polyhedral. Okay. So there's my first part of the wing. Tell you guys be careful when uh, using sharp knives don't get your fingers in the way slow cuts are better than uh, one deep cut Don't worry about that little edge there. Don't worry about that. the center okay don't get them the wrong way around okay so to keep this straight and give it a bit of strength what I've done is put one of these cocktail sticks into it I've melted a groove and put it in so from the trailing edge I have measured three centimeters three centimeters drawn a line okay and now what I'm going to do is use a hot iron and I create a groove down there I'm going to put my cocktail stick in there with a bit of hot milk glue heated an iron up steel ruler So it will go fully flush. There you go. That one does. I can turn this one off now. Now it's a case of just getting some hot milk glue and put it in. Okay. I use this on the edge there like that. Milk glue. I've got the hot milk glue in there. Make sure you get that perfectly lined up. There we go. Perfectly straight. 